Hi, I'm Dr. Slonum. I want to treat your uterine fibroids. I've been an interventional radiologist for 14 years. Actually, when I went into medicine, I thought I was going to be an OBGYN. That was my very first thought. Then I thought I was going to be a surgeon. Finally, I realized that the way to go is interventional radiology. I trained at Stanford in interventional, where we do all kinds of cutting edge procedures. A hysterectomy is such a common surgery and so often it's unnecessary and a lot of women want to keep their uterus and I don't think men understand that. Uterine fibroid embolization is an elegant solution to a difficult problem. I'm finding that more women are educating themselves. More and more women find me on the internet. They Google fibroids or fibroid embolization and then they don't want to just be given the one option of a hysterectomy. They know what to expect. They come in with very good questions of what I can offer them, what are the alternatives, what to expect. They are self-directed more and more. Women in the workplace, they don't want to be out after hysterectomy for two months. They want to be able to return to work and feel pretty good after a week and we can offer that solution. Once they've looked on the internet and found the procedure, then they come to me and they are given all the treatment options for fibroids and they're empowered to make the decision themselves of what is the best thing for them, for their lifestyle, for their work requirements, for their family, for their personal situation. It's a personal decision and you make a, a good decision when you have the options laid out in front of you. And then once they go through the procedure, they can get back to their life without all the problems associated with the fibroids. We strive to be very focused on the patient's experience, on your experience. I'll tell you, I don't believe in pain. I'm afraid of needles. I have to lie down to have my blood drawn because I'm so afraid of needles. And I think that makes me more compassionate. I imagine myself or my family member on the table when the procedure's going on and I'm gonna treat you like you're my sister. I don't want you to be uncomfortable. So from the time you come to our center, whether you're at our center where we bake fresh cookies every day, smells like home when you walk in, to trying to make it convenient for you. Our hours are long. We start early in the morning. We stay late in the day to see you before the procedure. We do consults out of several facilities, whether it's at our outpatient center, at one of the hospitals, at a hospital that's close to you, depending on where you live to making sure that you're comfortable during the procedure, your family is accounted for during the procedure, we want them to be comfortable as well, and planning for your discharge. I always make sure that whoever's there with you has your prescriptions filled before you go home so that when you get home, you already have your pain medicine, you already have your nausea medicine. We focus on the details so that you're gonna be as comfortable and relaxed as you can be. Educate empower, enjoy life.